put him spellbound with this 69 position you can start to kiss him from his toes down to his thighs and you know now you know here next and these are the things women of the world do to hold their men spare bound and you know those men are men who are warriors in the field hi guys it's your girl Omine Obindo you can call me the juicy Omine because I, come, because I come with a lot of juice on this channel so I know you don't want to miss any of my episodes if you are new here what are you waiting for please hit the subscribe button to get notified if I post a new videos and if you are my returning subscriber you are, you are highly highly welcome I love you so guys today we are going to be talking about Sergio fantasy so guys today's episode is hold him spellbound in the position 69 have you ever imagined such fantasy before if not don't worry i'm going to take you through that special fantasy and you'll be dripping dripping jeez so today I'm going to be sharing with you three sexual fantasies that I have always have at the back of my mind. It's weird. But only for the crazy and only for the freaky. If you are that holy and thou person, please, this video is for you. So if this is the kind of video you would like to see, then hit the subscribe button for more. So keep watching. So guys, everyone do have sexual fantasies at the back of their mind. Something that gets them turned on whenever they set their thoughts on them. Men and women, everyone are sexual beings and we are allowed legally if we are married to enjoy these fantasies. As long as they are conscientious, reversible, informed, and specific, you can carry them out. So don't think you are wide if you have some kind of fantasies. So here are some of my sexual fantasy that, that you and your partner can bring to life if you and your partner are experiencing some kind of boredom in the bedroom. 1. Exhibitionism Number one is exhibitionism. <laughs> Crazy as it is called. Exhibitionism is all about you putting on a show for him to watch. And this can be incredibly sexy. This is when you dance sexually and you strip slowly one piece at a time and in a way that sets his blood on fire for you then you go about touching yourself <laughs> listen men want freaky freaky things leave all those pretense they do when they come outside <laughs> Honey, that is the only way for you to get them to do whatever you want him to do for you at that time. Do you understand? Now, here is the plot twist to render him handicapped by tying his hands to the bedpost. <laughs> and don't forget to play that Sergio song while you are crawling up into the bed slowly and kiss him from his toes down into that big 69 where he sees your axe up on his face but he can't reach it and then you suck him suck it to the point that he can't hold it anymore He's begging to be untied 
<laughs> he wants to be untied. He wants to get his lip, his tongue in your pussy. But he can't because he has been tied up. And what he has is just your body in front of his face. Juicy, all dripping slowly. And then you have mercy on him by sitting on his face. And two of you got to have that full bliss that the 69 position got to offer. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> I'm already getting turned on by this. God, bring my husband to me. <laughs> you guys that are married, you don't know what you are enjoying. So, watch out for part two. I'm going to be drawing the cutting on this junction. So, I'll see you again in the next video. I love you. I remember my humble self for new below. You love me.